What's up, fam? What's up, fam? What's up, fam? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get on, man. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Let me turn this little down a little bit there. You know what I'm saying? Fix this up right here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we here. We here. We here. You know what I'm saying? This little short one. You know what I'm saying? Little short one. Has Brian McKnight become a passport bro? Has Brian McKnight become a passport bro? But see what he's talking about. Hmm. I don't know who's going through all this controversy stuff here to about um yesterday, you know what I'm saying? That um Brian McKnight has says, F the kids, you know, F his kids, you know what I'm saying? His seeds. You no, know, he said forget them, he got out of his life. It's like, wow, you know what I'm saying? He got a son, Brian McKnight Jr. Now he got some a new junior, you know what I'm saying? That's what I was saying, you know, his homeboy um the passport bro now. He left his black woman and went and got him an Asian woman, you know what I'm saying? With some nice little store-bought joints. It looked like about some, it looked like 40, about 42 Ds or something like that. There's some nice joints up there, you know what I'm saying? Pushed up, you know what I'm saying? A little fine thing. I, I say nothing against this woman here, even though she's a little trifle too, you know, things that she's doing, sticking her nose, you know, into the business of um, Brian McKnight and his um, original black kids, you know? Sending little messages to him, so acting like hope everything's okay with you, you know, saying stuff like that, but knowing that her kids getting all the benefits. Hmm? He said, F them kids, yeah. Got my new Brian McKnight Jr. <laughs> How you do things like that, dear? You know what I'm saying? Making tweets. Talk about the kids that he have now are like the best thing in his life. You know, since they came in his life, he know how to be, how to feel to be a man and have compassion and love for a family and all this wild, wild shit. But when he's with them black family there, it wasn't like that. What went wrong? Brian, what went wrong? Tell the truth. You know, what was going on there? Why'd you just leave them? I must do some more research. I'm sure he has some kind of re responses on here I did not see, but I'm going to check them things out there. But um, I don't see no kind of response that you can validate you disrespecting and disowning your seeds. You know what I'm saying? They got two boys and a girl. You know what I'm saying? But now he got um, I think two, two boys and a girl. The other one, but they one is his. A boy is his. And she had two um big older older children. He's out there, you know, hitting a circuit with them. Paris, you know what I'm saying? And Amsterdam, Monaco, doing lots of things with them. But the daughter, I think, of Brandon Mercedes Benz. Look like a coupe. Some fly joint. I'm like, wow, I look custom made to me, fam. While his kids at home, the original ones, they came out of his loins. They're starving. They're starving. He don't give a goddamn. He's really, <laughs> I was like, yo, this dude has no kind of feelings for them no more. He's like, forget them. Nope, he's putting constant tweets, putting the stuff aside down. His children's face is like, Forget y'all. Y'all nothing. I have no feelings for y'all. You know what I'm saying? No kind of, um, no telephone calls. You know what I'm saying? No checkups. Like, how you doing? You know what I'm saying? None of that there. He ain't doing shit. Brian Knight is a piece of shit. <laughs> That's what this dude is a piece of shit. No matter what response is, why he's doing this here, I do not know. For you to disown your family like that, your seeds, your daughter. What, what, what went on? Did they conspire to kill you or something? You know what I'm saying? They put some kind of rat poison in your Cheerios or some shit? I do not know, but I doubt it. This dude seems a little weird. You no, know, he's very a little weird there to do things like that. Any man who do something like that is a weirdo. You know what I'm saying? There's no kind of thinking about it. If you got some kind of problem with your woman and your children, that's in-house. That's not to be put on tweets. All the stupid social media shit there. Anybody that put their um their business on social media, they have a problem. No matter how they try to put the problem on someone else, saying, oh, he did this, she did this, he did this, she did this. For you to put that shit out there, it shows weakness. You know, that definitely shows weakness. And it shows that person got a goddamn problem. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. It's low self-esteem, I do not know. But I ain't got that goddamn problem. Why? Because I'm a Leo. <laughs> yeah, I'm a Leo, right? But Brian McKnight, he's like, F them kids, man, throwing the tweets out and stuff, man, it's real disgusting. Real disgusting. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what this lady did to make him a passport, bro. No, we got my, no, a fine Asian woman. 
I don't know her, her roots there. She looks look like Philippine to me. I don't think she I don't think she's tired. She looks Philippine. You know what I'm saying? She got that Philippine look on her. She's a fine woman and voluptuous too, you know what I'm saying, fam? Yeah. But why did you leave the family there? Why you disown your children, Brian? Huh? Why you treating the other new kids? You no, know, he's a stepdaddy. He's a proud stepdaddy. You know what I'm saying? If you look at my videos, you might see I am saying stepdaddies are suckers. Which they are suckers. And Brian Knight is a sucker, you know what I'm saying? He got money. He said he, all his money is going to um, the new kids, all the inheritance. He said these, um, the ones that came out of them loins, the black ones, they're not getting a dime of his money. Not a dime of his money. So all his um, hard work he did through all his years, all the singing he's been doing there is going to them kids. Yeah, and that woman, he's very proud and happy. Very proud and happy of it, yeah. Tweeting of it. He's a goddamn fool. That's a black fool. Yeah, that's a black fool. Yeah, I say he's a black fool. Do some shit. Yeah, he is. Yeah, he's a black foolish man. I'm not saying he's a black foolish man to go get him some Asian meat. No, hell no. I don't give a fuck what he want to do. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying the diss on your kids. I wouldn't care if he went with a goddamn on train. You're a goddamn dude. That's his business. I'm calling a sucker for leaving his kids. You know what I'm saying? Disown them, you know what I'm saying? It's like don't give them nothing no more. I'm sure they need, they need, they young. You know what I'm saying? Put up on the house. You they ain't do nothing like that there. He buying the goddamn stepdaughters and them fucking big ass brand new Mercedes businesses for their birthday. You can't call your seeds up. You might say, oh, they're not um grateful or something like that there. No matter what, you don't cut them off like that. You know what I'm saying? Not all like that. Like I said, unless they put some kind of rat poison inside your Cheerios or some shit, you know what I'm saying? Spiking your beers at night with some kind of technical droplets or some shit trying to kill your ass. Other than that, there, there's no excuse for that shit there. So, um, Brian McKnight, he is a sucker. He is a sucker. Stepdads are suckers. I'm not going to fall back from that, dear. A stepdad is a sucker. You're taking on responsibility to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Maybe that man's in prison, but he better wait till he get out of prison to take care of his goddamn family. Oh, maybe he's dead. Ooh, rest in peace. And I'm out, fam. Peace.